Hello and welcome to the course on bare metal embedded programming with Hatmega 328 microcontroller. I am Aravinda Verma, your instructor for the course. AVR tool is an open source tool used to program the on-chip memory of AVR microcontrollers. AVR Dude is an acronym for AVR Downloader Uploader. It can be used to program flash and EEPROM memories. If the serial programming protocol is supported, it can be used to program fuse and lock bits. AVR Dude can be used in two different modes. Command line and interactive mode. Command line mode is preferred to read or write the entire memory from a file, whereas interactive mode is used for exploring the memory content, modifying the individual byte of EEPROM, programming fuse bit and lock bits, etc. AVR Dude provides various options to work with and can be listed with the command zone. Let's look at a few options which are frequently used across our projects. Minus C. Note the capital C. This option is used to specify the config file for configuration data. The file contains all the programmer and microcontroller definitions that AVR Dude knows about. If you have a programmer or a microcontroller that AVR Dude doesn't know about, you can add it to the config file. If the option is not specified, AVR Dude searches for the config file in default location. In Linux, it looks in slash USR, slash local, slash etc directory. And in Windows, it searches for the config file in current directory and the directories listed in path variable. We have updated the path variable with the location of bin directory where the tool and config file is placed. Minus P is the only mandatory option and it tells AVR Dude what type of microcontroller is connected to the programmer. Its parameter must be the part ID listed in the config file. Minus B option overrides the serial communication baud rate specified in the respective programmer's entry of the configuration file. Minus C. Notice the small case. This option specifies the programmer to be used. AVR Dude knows about several common programmers. Use this option to specify the one you are using. Minus P, note the capital letter. This option is used to identify the port to which the programmer is attached to. We shall discuss how to identify the port to which the programmer is attached in the later lecture. Minus V option enables verbose output. Use this option to get more detail of the command used. Minus U. Note the capital letter. This option specifies the memory operation to be performed. Multiple minus U options can be specified in order to operate on multiple memories on the same command line invocation. It is an important option and we shall be using it frequently. Let's look at the minus U option in detail. The option takes various parameters which define the memory type to be programmed, the operation to be performed, the source or destination file to be read or written into, and the format of the specified file. AVR Dude supports various memory types present on the microcontroller. MemType option is used to specify the type of the on-chip memory to be programmed. 
In our projects, we shall be working with three types of memory, namely flash, EEPROM, and fuse and lock bits. OP specifies the read, write, and verify operations. A file must be specified with this option. In the case of read operation, the content of the on-chip memory is read and written into the specified file. In write operation, the content of the file specified is written to the on-chip memory. In verify operation, the content of the specified file and the on-chip memory is read and verified. The command supports various binary file formats to read from and write to. However, we shall use Intel hex file format throughout our project. While programming the fuse and lock bits, the option M is specified instead of the file name to identify the immediate value supplied with the command. I encourage you to explore more about the AVRDoit program. I hope you must have enjoyed the lesson and learned something new. Thank you and have fun learning.